Hey guys, what's up? Eric here. So recently I finished my midterms. If you are unfamiliar with what midterms are, basically what they are, are they, they are tests that test you on things you have learned throughout the semester. So that's like, what, like five months of learning all put into one test. It's a lot of stuff. As you can imagine, it took me forever to study for these things, considering I have six classes, and that means I had to study for six midterms. I mean, it's so hard for me to study for one hour. How can I study for five hours in one day? Ain't nobody got time for that. In fact, I was studying so much for these tests that I would fall asleep while I was studying for so it. So I would just doze off without knowing it, and then an hour later, I would wake up in a pile of drool. Don't act like that's never happened to you. The annoying part of this is, is that my, my finals were right after winter break. So basically, I had to study over winter break. Is it the whole point of winter break to have a break? So of course I was celebrating, you know, all the holidays and stuff, but then I had this over my head, you need to study for your exams, you need to study for your exams, you need to study for your exams. That's stressful, I'm trying to have fun over break, but then I have these tests hovering over my head. Ugh. Another thing that didn't really help me is that I procrastinated a lot. I would say to myself, all right, I'm gonna start studying this subject at five o'clock. And then I'd be lazy and you know, be like, you know what, I'm gonna study this at 5.15, 5.30, and then I just kept putting it off. And then once I started studying, it was one o'clock in the morning. Even though I felt prepared for these tests, that doesn't mean I wasn't nervous because, well, I was really nervous. My hands would start sweating, I would start taking deep breaths, I even said a little prayer to myself. Oh dear God, please help me during these finals. And taking these tests is really stressful. Once I got caught up on one problem instead of skipping over it, you know, like what teachers tell you to do is like, if you don't know it, skip over it and go back to it. Well, I was stuck on this one problem and it stressed me out. And then I realized there were like 80 more questions I needed to answer. Ugh. Time management, do that. Sometimes these tests are long and I mean really, really long. The worst part is, is when you think you're almost done and you're about to turn in your test to the teacher, you turn over the page and you realize you have to write an entire essay on communism. What? What? I don't know if this is only me, but sometimes while I'm taking my test, I feel like I'm being judged by my classmates. Eric's still taking the test, what a loser. I don't know if any of you feel that way. I know it seems really silly to really like, I mean, I shouldn't care about what other people like think about me while I'm taking the test, but I don't know. I feel like I'm being judged all the time. If you'll take anything away from this video, take away this. If you finish the test a little early, make sure to bring something to work on or to study because I forgot to, to bring my study guide for the test I had the next day and I had nothing to do. So I ended up drawing Caillou. That's, that's how bored I was. I drew Kai, you guys. So now that all that stress is gone, I'll be able to make more videos for you guys. Hopefully there will be videos every week. I'm not promising anything, but you know, there will probably be videos every week because I do have a busy schedule. Wait, I don't have a life. I don't have a busy schedule. So yes, there will be videos every week. And remember to follow me on Instagram at Eric Moran Films for random updates and what's not. So thank you guys so much for watching this video and I will see you guys next week. Take care guys.